Hello everyone and welcome back. I have another awesome thrift store find of the day. I ran through the thrift stores, I don't know, maybe a week ago and I found this. And if you guys watch my videos that I have over on the Jones Act Survival Channel, you know that I do a lot of crayfishing up north here, crawfishing down south, all my mud bugging videos. And I have a couple where I actually do a boil. When I do a boil, I usually use this one, but it doesn't have a basket in it. Now my girlfriend Melissa down in Louisiana, she bought me this one here. This is like 120 quart. It's huge. I mean, this is what you use if you have a 40 pound sack of crawfish. So I think with this one here, I've kind of found a happy medium. When I catch them here, I maybe get five pounds. I don't get all that many up here, and it's yeah, I really don't want to boil them in that big one. And Melissa, she says, I've just got too much Yankee and not enough coon ass in me to catch 40 pounds. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to give you a look at this because this is like brand new. When I looked this up online, the closest thing I could find, I couldn't find this exact one, but the closest thing was about $120. And I paid $19.99. As you'll be able to see here, this thing is still brand new. Here, take a look inside. Everything still has the plastic on it and everything. So you can see here it comes with a smaller basket up on top. This is more for steaming seafood. You can also do poultry in here. I imagine a chicken. I don't know if you could really fit it. Well, you could fit a smaller turkey in there so it comes with the hook. But what I really am interested in is this basket right here. Perfect for five pounds, even maybe eight pounds of crayfish that I catch up here in Minnesota. So when I get the smaller batches, I can finally do a boil and have a basket. Actually, looking inside of here, you could probably do, I don't know, maybe an 8 pound turkey in here, but I think chickens would be better. But all I really want it for is for cooking up some mud bugs. Okay everyone, well thanks a lot for watching. Uh, for me, with the mud bugging season coming right around the corner, I just have a, two or three weeks until we can finally get out there and throw some traps in. I'm excited. This is perfect for what I need it for. And I think another awesome thrift store find of the day. We'll see you guys on the next video.